at the fourth, following his birdie. Vajegas takes it two in a row. Yeah, for his second birdie in a row. Birdie at the par three, and now follows that up. And we go to the fifth hole. Looking for three in a row. That would give him the lead. Finds himself co-leader, now 225 downhill downwind. Just look for something towards middle of the green. Though playing the sixth most difficult today. Something a little bit like that. Plenty of birdie opportunities on this golf course, so you don't have to slam the threes. You gotta get the fives. The putter has behaved most of the time. So a lot of good putts have gone in and some haven't. Yeah, he has really struck his golf ball pretty well, but that was a little miscue on the pace. Well, Vegas, really nicely done. Confident you, you, putt. You mentioned those mid-round par saving putts. That's one that you might want to put an asterisk next to. At the 12th, here's Vajegas, a long putt for birdie. It's be a good litmus test, up a rise, straight down wind and into the green. And I think you would have liked that a little closer, John. He's kind of in that uh, territory. He made a nice one on the front nine. Two-shot swing here. Yeah. Yeah. Looked comfortable on that. Craig just stepped up, went right straight through his routine, knocked it right in the center. Like I said, that's a big confidence boost. He's found something that's really working. He doesn't have to think about it. He can just get up and play golf. Man, has he hit it well, too. Seven iron and nice. turning back towards the flag. Just needs a kick forward. Another quality golf shot there, Craig. Right at hole high from 235. Really good look Great at Birdie. Uh, that's exactly what he's done. This is absolutely perfect. Yeah, he kind of looking for that tee pretty quickly, so he is very pleased. That is still going right there next to Alex Noren's ball. Turns this golf hole into a birdie opportunity. Uh, just 95 yards. He's seen a couple of good ones in front of him. Don't have to worry about the spin, just to control the distance. Stick right there, Craig. What a great answer. Rattling the stick, Bajagas. He has been so money with those wedges all week. Norn and Schmid in there close. He's the last to play from the fairway. Wedge in hand. Bajagas flag hunting at 15. Just don't cross your line like you said, John. Yeah, you gotta stay away from crossing your line, but he's been so good about playing Turning the proper shot. Oh, got a fortunate little kick up onto the green, and now underneath the hole there, Craig, excellent shot. And it shows how much confidence he has to, with the one-shot lead to stand up here with driver. Stepping Just right a up. low bullet and cutting. See how he kind of chipped it? That was like a little chippy driver. Boy, is he playing some shots. What a lovely yeah, from Vegas. Awesome to watch. 225 front. I think you have enough firepower to get there. Uh, this also riding on the wind. Ride right of Smith. Got down in the bunker. Pins Into the on flat the area. So all three guys missing the 17th. Be huh? testing their short games when we return. Again, ball just not sitting well. I think running away from him. Getting in there pretty quick. He was ready to go. And how oh, spectacular was that? Is the highest. All about confidence, contact, keeping that speed up. You see how he just got through that, kept that face open, landed perfectly. Little check, release down that hill. He went in there confidently, played it quickly. would be his fourth straight day birdie in 17 and this would be the one that would matter the most yeah I was gonna say that he, he stepped in there Matty Schmidt hadn't even played his third yet and he just wanted uh, Alex Noren to see it Dustin driver he's made wonderful golf swings he gets in there pretty quick confidently 
Well, aim right, started right, and trying to use the wind. Magnificent. Yeah, that got a friendly bounce, and just to the left of those bunkers. Yeah, just 125, bring it in low. Enjoy the walk. Yeah, wants to get it back there on that back shelf. He's safely on. Vegas will put a mark on it, and he'll have that for his fifth career win, first in 3,374 days. This left. Camilo Vajegas is back in the winner's circle. And this one's for me. Luis Ruiz on the bag. What a performance by Camilo Vajegas. Tied for second last week. A winner this week. Great play, mate. Well done. Well done. It was impressive, I gotta say. Tita Green on the green. A bunch of the Latin players there to celebrate with Vijegas, including Nico Echeverria. It was Vijegas who was there for Echeverria when he won in Puerto Rico. Yep. Comes full circle. The winning card. This a miracle to get back to the winner's circle. What a moment. It's, listen, it's been nine years since your last victory. Your first as a father, as a husband. We know how much you've endured. What's this journey been like? Oh, tough to put in words right now, but uh, wow, what a ride, man. You know what? I love this game. This game has given me so many great things. But in the process, it kicks, kicks your butt. Uh, Life has given me so many great things, and in the process, it kicks my butt, too. Um, and my little one up there watching. And, um, well, you know, it's a, it's, it's a big team. It's a huge team behind this. And uh, you got my wife, my little one, Mateo. I'm sure he's jumping. He's crazy. And uh, everybody that's been around. I mean, my instructor this year, Jose Campra, has been unbelievable. Eugenio, who I've been working on my mental side I've never felt so comfortable playing in the heat in the last couple of weeks and uh, he told me when we started he told me you know what I think you can win again on the PGA Tour I'm not sure I believed him to be honest but uh, here we are you know what it was a great battle today I stayed patient I uh, missed a couple coming in but that birdie on 17 was huge so all in all I just want to thank everybody that supported me over this journey and uh, and just want to let them know that I always give my best, and uh, that's why we're here. I think, Camilo, collectively, the golf world is smiling. Congratulations. <laughs> the support has been unbelievable. I mean, every angle. I mean, the amount of text messages I got last week. I mean, I must have got 500 text messages. I didn't even win the golf tournament. And um, I felt the energy. You know what? It, it kept building up. All the Everybody here on the island was great, and they, they just rooting me on. and. And um, you gotta believe in energy, man. And like I said, I got my little one up there, watching it, smiling. She's what she's she's where she needs to be after a long fight. And uh, to everybody, just want to say thanks. It's been a fun week.